Alright, hello YouTube and uh, welcome back to another video and welcome back to another um, to my channel. Um, so today I'll be talking about uh, cable management after this. suggests um, it's about cable management. No, not any cable man management like in your house or anywhere like that. If you're a DJ uh, in your in your DJ flight case or cases, if you've got multiple such as myself, yes, the right, uh, yes, that's right, inside flight cases and. Uh, Obviously, th this is huge, and it's got cables below inside, and uh, it, as you can tell, it's oh, stacks them. Uh, but charges from that box. If I get my cables, for, if I'm taking this flight case, and um, charges are in there. Um, every single device is connected as is. So, basically when you connect your devices, say if I want uh, my main left out, and I want to go to my le main left out amplifiers, I'll connect those two into a couple of devices, so crossovers. P uh, crossover limit, uh, the limiter compressors, I'll plug those two in, cable tie them up, put them to one side, the limiters, to my amplifiers, cable tie those cables up, and then tie them together. Done. And then, and that goes with my monitor system and my base system. Because it, there's three systems in this one flight case alone. So um So I've got uh, a four-channel microphone system in here, which goes through every single one of them by that soundboard that I showed you earlier. And about this rig up here, pretty clever. Well, I wouldn't say clever, but it's neater and easier. Uh, so basically, these four are for uh, microphones. And then USB CD player, the next one, on the fifth one. Then you got my audio for, from the controller. And then I've got USB charger. So if I want to charge my iPhone or whatever, charge on that. And then I've got my controller USB. So all I need to do is hook up at the front. And it's Go, this will go straight to my Mac. And then, uh, record. Now, r remember in one of the videos that I posted earlier, is about having to not take an extra board to do the recording job. Well, there's your USB connection. Right there. Anything that goes into that board comes out the back here but to my amplifiers and to the record. And it's so simple. And I wanted one of these boards for ages and never got around to buying one. So yeah, it, it, that connection into that cable to the top, into that to the top, into my other bank. And it records. 
then uh, it's the same goes with the power cables. Neaten them up. Because you see some DJs that have controller, laptop, a couple of lights, one amplifier, maybe two if they're running bins, and all the cables are on display. It's not good for the client. So, um, like what and what I said into one of the other videos is I'm doing both DJ booths up. So all the con cables contained within the booths, the only cables are on show, which only very minimal of, are for the speakers. And the speakers are like, that's it. Um, and possibly a corded mic. If uh, if you've got a only a, a corded mic, not wireless, and that's it. You don't need to check any other cables. And yeah, it's it's quite simple really. Uh, because what I've done is I've shown you in one of the other videos is I've done connections there. So I don't need to go in the back of the amplifiers or in, inside this flat case at all for no damn reason. It's connect up there, connect up top, that's it. And if there is any problems within this flat case, it's just turning that one amplifier off, changing the connections on the side, and deal with that amplifier later. It's just easy. Easy as one, two, three. Uh, so, and as you can tell, I've got so many devices in this flight case, uh, it exceeds six mains hours. So, simple way of doing it. That one is for an extension in there, which for the MacBook chargers and something else. And then another one of these, I can't remember which one, that goes to all those. So it's plain and simple, really. And all the connections I need to hook up are at the front. Just bring them out, connect them all up here, and one down there. And then obviously that, that's power con in. And then with the passive st system, if I'm running all 14 on my speakers, plugged in, into the side there, which I do once a year, and that's it. So yeah, uh, but if I wanted to, I can take my second main amp, which is here, which is jack powered, into my actors. Done deal. So yeah, there's quite a lot of power within this one flight case. Now, if I turn it around, so you won't see any of those cables whatsoever. simple it is. Now what I was saying to you about uh, cables hooking up here, those are them. The batteries from the wireless mics, done. Wireless mics and covers, done. All hidden in there. And you're asking, where am I going to put my controller if I'm DJing with this flat case? That has been done already. Right there, sorted. And uh, when I'm done, pull them back, make sure I've got enough room so I can actually pull them out. And obviously, you've probably seen this flight case before, the uh, monitor limiter, feedback destroyer for the monitors, and to my mains, which go into this. Uh, which uh, 
we'll cross over into that, the another limiter which goes into base and mains. Very complicated, but it works. USB CD player works again. Wireless microphone system which goes up to here, and then done. So those the only two within this rack goes up here, and all the rest are connected from here down. And you see none of it. No cables. Nobody knows how much equipment you've got in this flat case. Not one person. But yourself. So, and it, it's, uh, it's also fire, fire management. It keeps the fire at bay unless you put in a duff cable. Really, it's if you don't sort your cables out after your first gig, you've got no hope of getting more gigs. So, sort your cables out, get your gear into action, neaten it all up, and get on with it. By that way, you're getting more gigs. So. I don't know what else to add into that, but just keep your equipment neat. Cable management, that's all it is. So, with that being said, that is it for now, but remember, always keep tidy no matter what. Goodbye for now.